There were a few international names on that highlight, and KUJH reporter Jen Halverson was at Kansas's last match to tell us more about Anastasia Richagova. The Kansas women's tennis team is filled with international flavor this year. Girls from South Africa, Russia, and Chile have come to compete in the Big 12 Conference. We caught up with Anastasia Richagova today to find out how she's adjusting to the new style of play. It's definitely different, but I, I think I have a lot of support here from my coaches and from my teammates, so it's it's much easier to play in here because like I didn't really feel I had as much support I have here. Richagova has competed all over the world, winning numerous junior opens in her early years. She has quickly established herself on the team as the number one contender, even snagging the coveted Big 12 Player of the Week status. She's not one that's ever going to quit. And so from that standpoint, it's infectious for our team. And so uh, them re seeing the confidence she has in herself, no matter what the situation is, is big for the rest of them to see that. Although Richa Gova is in her first year at KU, she's not the only one getting a shot at the starting lineup. Three out of the four starters this season are from other countries and all happen to be freshmen. The undefeated Jayhawks are becoming known for their consistency and strength to persevere in the last few sets, ultimately winning each match. Coach Chapman says that this is their key to success. Focus is still on playing our best tennis as the year goes on, getting better and better and all for each of them. We're such a young team right now for our, in our mind if if we continue uh, to develop each player then as a team all the accolades we want or the the goals we may have are going to take care of themselves reporting for KUJH sports i'm jen halverson richagova collected two wins in ku's last match against colorado now colorado tennis fans in denver i might mm -hmm. add may not